All right, guys, welcome back to part six of the Final Fantasy VII Remake playthrough. Hope you are all well. And we're going to pick up from where we went left off in the previous episode. We are... The minutes. We are... We are currently just doing some side quests in the Sector 5 slums here. We've helped out a few people. And we've got to go to the boys' hideout here, I think. I probably want to speak to Chadley though as well because I think uh, we got we've completed one of the quests. They might have something new for us. Research complete. I've done it. I've done it. All right, what have you got? Synergy materia allows an ally to follow the leader's attack command with an attack from linked materia. Works with fire, ice, lightning, wind, and poison. All right, interesting. We did, um, so the last couple of days we've been getting through bits and pieces. Today we actually got through um, two of Leo's maps. And then we played another one, which was on the request queue um, called Pent, I think. And the description said it was a 10 out of 10. It's been on there for like over a year. Now that things are starting to settle down a bit, we can finally play whack -a -box again. It's been on the workshop and on my queue for about a year. Um, and it was rated 10 out of 10 difficulty. Hardly anybody has... Nobody's commented on it. I don't think it's had many plays. And it was just... It was all over the place. There was signage everywhere. There was multiple signage. The signage kind of was just... I, it was just a mess. And I don't know if I'm going to go back to it or not. It just seems like the difficulty comes in understanding what everything does. So, I don't know. I might... Once we're like through with Final Fantasy VII, maybe we'll have a... Maybe some longer portal streams, uh, one or two, just sort of break before our next game. So maybe we'll just like try and throw it into a longer stream, and we'll see if we can like all club together and, and solve it. Because I honestly, I don't think I can probably, I don't think I can solve it myself because it was just, it was just completely crazy. It's all uh, anyway. to you. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's this tired-looking guy out by the community center, and I heard he was looking for some help. All right. There's a lot of quests to do in the uh, Sector 5 here. Just like you. Oh, a hey, lot Cloud. of side quests. You're just in time for our favorite game, Whack-A-Box. You want in? It's super fun. The rules are sure. easy. The person who whacks the most boxes is crowned champion of the hideout. We usually don't let adults play, but since you're cool, we're going to make a special exception just for you. Since you're cool, Cloud. All right, so what's the... David Snape, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're well. So we got a Moogle Medal anyway, or we get a Cogwheel, Crescent Moon Charm, or an Elixir, depending on how well we do on this. Sure, let's play a game of Whack-A-Box. Draw as many boxes as possible with the time limit. Each box will add to your score, and once the time reaches zero, the game is over. Reach the target score to win. Durability effects... Durability, effects, and score differ with each type of box. So I'm guessing like that massive 1500 one behind is going to be pretty pretty hard to uh, hit, right? Hit blue box rapidly fills your ATB gauge. In Wacker box, you can only use your weapons ability or of your equipped weapon and the braver ability. Okay, fair enough. Run red boxes. Extend your team. Right. Let's go. Should be interesting. <laughs> Am I actually hitting this box? I don't know. Wow, that was a... Maybe I should have gone into punisher mode for that, actually. I don't know if I'm hitting this. Oh, I am. Okay, 
take your rage out on this. Oh, I'm in operator mode. Sorry, punisher mode. Ten seconds. Is that what you're gonna give me? Let's use Braver, so let me use Triple Slash. Not gonna complain like, but Alright. We're almost we're almost at the target. We're at the target. We won. We win. We win. I haven't installed portal? How dare you. Gave from chapter 10 because I found it ever so... Well, it's fine. It's not to be like that, is there? Uh, like, like what I mean by that is don't just be like disheartened with yourself. If you feel like you need like time to... Feel like you need time to actually get back into it, then obviously I think your approach of maybe playing Portal 1 and Portal 2 again is probably not a bad thing. So, we are a Crate Annihilator. I mean, maybe as well, as well as playing the original games, um, maybe also consider playing uh, the mods that are free, like, uh, I think your retire machine's a bit iffy, but maybe Portal Stories Mel, and if you're not looking, not up to the challenge of Portal Stories Mel in, like, the normal mode, there's the, um, oh, what's, what's, because they split it out, didn't they? they? They made an easier version of it. I can't think, I can't remember for the life of me what they made or called the easier version. Was story mode the easy version? Or was it... It's I can't remember if like story mode's the easy version or if like there's an advanced mode. I, I can't remember which way around it was. No, that's fine. Fine. It's crazy. I mean, you know, every, everybody's free to do what they want, but thanks. Thanks anyway. I appreciate it. Appreciate the plug. Door has been unlocked. Going in. Sorry, but we're in a rush. Pushing it. I'm coming. Bring it. Um. Ah, awkward. I don't have any way to heal. Way to go. Every little bit helps. So long. Let's see that. And I can't dodge. I gotta work on my dodging in this game. To cure cloud. You've got this. Great. Okay. You're mine. So tired. Ah, we're asleep. Oh, good. I'll tell you what I can. Ah. All the time. Fine. Brace yourself. Yeah, I didn't sound aggressive at all. I'm silly. Come on. I don't want to switch it up. Come on. I'm waiting. Get him. Can I have some like hills, Aerith, please? 
after you. I'll, I'll do what I can. Um, yikes. Oh, we got region? Everyone else got region. I'll take care of you. Uh, sure. Gotta heal first. <laughs> Gotta be careful. So tired. Ah, uh, every time. Sends me to sleep. We've right. gotta get through this. Gotta go for it now. This one's for you! Stop it! Get ripped here. Yeah. I'm feeling Fight pain. through it. I can't keep going. Need to heal up. All good. I'm in trouble. Still poison, Donna, yeah. Gotta stay. I got anything that will cure my poison. Don't close your so much for being a mercenary. Wow, okay. Rip. I didn't expect them to like deal so much damage. It's crazy. Then crazy's new map, throw the cube, and you say the solution is very interesting. Ah. No worries, Doctress. We will catch you, or I will catch you tomorrow. Have a good evening, buddy. Have a good evening indeed. All right, so probably want to do sense here. Move that sensor so I can so I can see. And thanks to the host, crazy, appreciate it. At least see their weaknesses and things, and try and build up a bit of a. Strategy here. Yes. No turning back. Uh, right. Abilities. Test. Go. Best do it right. Ah! Just, just go away. That was a waste of ability because I totally didn't. I, I pressed the button before I was I ready. Um, all right, so weaknesses against it's weak against ice. Uh, well, that's about it. So we need to hit it with ice. I don't actually know if we've got any. I don't know if we've got any. Um... I don't know if I got cloud equipped with ice. <laughs> So let's do You can do it. All right. Maybe this will do it. Closure. Yeah! <laughs> 
don't like the fact that that one over there has like got a, a red glowing stomach. It doesn't can't be good, right? I'm winning. Thanks. Gotta be careful. I'll show you what I can do. Why don't you lead the way? Need to heal up. Cloud. Come on, Cloud. Come on, Cloud. Ready or not, here I come. Yeah, keep eyes open. Oh. Sleep now. They're both asleep. It's not good. They're both asleep. <laughs> Let's switch it up. I'll, I'll do what I can. All right, I need to kill me first. Then your cloud. Can you handle them? Great. Gotta stay. Man. I want to take this one out really first. This one's this one's almost gone. Whoa, 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 it's not good. You're still doing okay, right? Not looking good. Alright, got rid of one of them. I think. Bring it. Yeah, we got rid of one. So, heal up again. We need to definitely heal up Aerith. And then I'm just going to use a high potion on Cloud for now, just to see him through. All good. I'm now, summons, I can't summon. Summons, like, appear. Not randomly, Mika, but there's no way to, like, manually trigger it. A summon will only appear in, like, a real intense battle. It's hard to kind of... It's hard to explain. Alright, we're down to one. Down to one. So... Cloud needs to give Aerith... Huh? Should be alright now, because there's only one of them. One more shot. There we go. Yeah, that was a pretty tough fight for a for a um for like a side quest, definitely. Hey, you wanna say a prayer too? No thanks. I think you've got it covered. Alright, well, there we go. Best uh, heal up, and then we'll go back to the old man and tell him we've done that bit. X. 
Excellent. Uh, let me see if there's like a, there should be a way on here. If I look at uh, manual. Let's see if it says here. I don't think I can. Oh, yeah, yeah, summons can only be invoked in certain battles. So I think it's mainly like boss fights that, um, like proper boss fights, I mean, can actually summon. So. Remember to keep uh, cashing in our uh, Moogle medals as well. Ten out of ten disaster. <laughs> I owe him a lot. Maybe more than I can ever repay. And now I owe you a lot too. I know it's not much, but I hope it makes up for it a little bit. We paid our respects to your wife. And we took care of those creatures. Oh, that's such a relief to hear. I can't tell you how much it was weighing on my mind. I was beginning to think I might never be able to visit her grave again. With my bad back and my legs, my whole body's a mess, frankly. I... I didn't think I could make it past the creatures. But I was prepared to die trying, and then you two came along. Still, I've got to face facts. Creatures or no, I can't keep making these trips. Don't say that. This is the graveyard key. Run it back to Mark. But I just told you about my legs. Why don't you just give it back? Okay. It'll cost you 5,000 gil, though. 5,000? It's always money with you people. <laughs> Fine. I won't ask you for anything else. I'll take your damned key and give it to the boy. Wow. It's downright depressing. What is the world coming to these days? I think he's actually trying to give you a bit of um, motivation, if I'm honest. I might be wrong. That's all you kids think about. Not a It'd be interesting though, Adam, if we could like. I, I'd agree. I don't. I think I worked out a lot of that. I think I worked out a lot of that map, but there was just some little bits in the signage which was terrible, absolutely terrible. If I had enough time and I had more time, then probably I'd want. I, I think I could probably like settle down and sort it out, but. So I solved it, but I just don't think when I've already got so much, so many maps to get through, like the first place, I probably don't want to tie myself down on maps like that at the moment. So, uh, you wouldn't happen to be a certain merc that's become the talk of the town, maybe. Yep. I'm Damon, little more than a humble reporter with the daily buzz. Ah, uh, that rag. The one that's always printing awful rumors about the slums? On the contrary, my dear. We strive to raise awareness of the plight of our undercity brethren. We seek a better future for everyone, rich and poor. Now then, my friends, I find myself in need of your exceptional services for a trifling matter. Are you familiar with the mysterious and notorious bandit known as the Angel of the Slums? She delivers written declarations to her victims, usually Shinra associates, before divesting them of their valuables. Everyone knows her. Everything she steals, she gives to the poor and needy. Like a Robin Hood? Yes, she's got a knack for public relations. Very popular down here. As Robin Hood of the Final Fantasy VII Nevertheless, world. she is a criminal and a threat to the public order. I've made it my mission to unmask the villain. But the locals have been uncooperative and uncommunicative, to put it mildly. Now that my identity as a reporter has been exposed, my sources have all deserted me. 
Which brings me to you. Work of the hour, and the man who will serve up my scoop. of the slums? Such a mysterious figure. Always talked about, but never seen by anyone. The angel gets in and out without being noticed and always leaves a calling card. <gasps> Maybe a magician. No, no, it's no magic trick. It's genuine magic. Rumor has it that the angel is a witch. If we're going by rumors, then I've heard that it's actually a monster in disguise. Well, nice. I could talk all day about the dozens of stories I've heard. Okay. Yeah, does that guy look like Stanley? What's that? The guardian angel of the slums? Come to think of it, a reporter came sniffing around asking about her. You his man? Huh. Even if I knew something, I wouldn't tell you. To folks around here, the angel is a hero. I ain't selling her out to Shinra. Oh, can't believe you can get paid to dig up people's secrets. Even a bandit makes a more honest living than that reporter. Oh, can't believe you can get paid to dig up people's secrets. Even a bandit. Those were good times. I don't think I can listen to another. What else got anything to say on this? What? Do I know the guardian angel of the slums? Well, I don't know much, but I do know she doesn't steal from the poor, and she doesn't kill anyone either. As far as I'm concerned, that's all I need to know. If that's not enough for you, the one you ought to talk to is Marae. Ask anyone, and they'll tell you she knows everything about everyone around here. If I were you, I'd talk to Marae. Where will I find Marae? Good to see you again, Marae. This is Marae. Good to see you too, Aerith. I'd heard you found yourself a funny new friend. I don't think I've ever watched the Robin Hood cartoon. Mireille. She knows everything there is to know about the slums. Mireille, meet Cloud. He's a former soldier and super strong. Hmm. He looks useful enough. The kids have been talking about you. The defender of the secret hideout. And now the hero of the Leaf House is helping the Daily Buzz look for the angel of the slums. I am? <laughs> I'm a lover of the whispered word. Not that it's any real secret, considering how chatty that Shinra Mutt's been. Not looking into it for the reporter. I'm doing it for myself. Call it curiosity, whatever. Or could it be you've fallen under the angel's spell like so many others? Anyway, it so happens that I have some information for you. But I'll need a moment before I can give it to you. Why don't you wait with that reporter of yours? Just wait outside with the reporter. I'll be along soon. So, any news? Have you tried talking to Marae at all? She told us that she had some information to share. Marae? As in THE Marae? The town gossip? I chased her for days begging for info, but she wouldn't give up a single scrap! So how do you get the old bird to talk? This old bird had a change of heart, that's all. Then quickly, before you have another, tell us. What do you know about the notorious angel of the slums? Has she struck again? Is that it? I don't know anything about that, but I do know where her hideout is. Her base of operations? Probably Marae. Now that's a scoop! Where is it? Tell me! Deep in the scrap, at Lookout Point. Hardly anyone goes out there these days. It's the perfect place for a criminal to hole up. Look out point. Got it. I'll check it out right now. But before you go, I should warn you about this rumor I heard. About a terrible fiend that's claimed the angel's hideout as its lair. Of course it's gonna oh, be like a... Quite large. Lots of teeth. A nasty one, me. man. I don't know about you, but I'd not go anywhere near that thing. Oh, well... Uh... That's where I come in, right? Well, a good reporter knows never to take foolish risks. Uh, plan first, then act. That's every respectable journalist motto. 
If it's a plan you're looking for, I'd say you have one right here. Wouldn't you? So, my good mercy. I bet Marae is really like the angel of the slums and her, her hideout's been overthrown by a, a demon. Some description. So now we're the ones that are going to go up on the clean up, clean up duty. All in it now. I think I've spent like more time in the last like two hours like running around this part of the slums. That's all I seem to be doing at the moment. Backwards and forwards to this part. I'm quite hopeful though this is the last of the uh, side quests. Get to listen to the jams. This is not the right way to go. Moving on there. Up here. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> it's a smogger. And it's a big smogger. Christ. All right, get ready to die. I don't see that it's got like big teeth though. Where be? Gen. No. You've got this. Back in it. No way. I'll take care of them. Um regen, so now he wants Barrier. Just taking a I little break. Whoa! Gotta be careful. Yikes! Come on, need a breather. So it's my turn. You can do it. All right. Stay strong, okay? Just, just go away. Steady. I gotta get away from that sphere. I've literally gotta. I've gotta stay away from the silenced. 
Have I got anything that will cure silence? Yeah. This one. Stay back. Bam. Go on. Can't get closer, that's the problem with this one. This guy. It's like silence me again. Because I can't go through the Because he's like doing these like uh, circle kind of attacks. I can't get close enough with him to actually attack him. For you. Keep it up. Oh, and now he's silenced there. Get ready. <laughs> Sorry, but My you turn. handle it. Oh, we got ten. Calling lightning. Man. Go on. Here it comes. No way. I'll show you what I can do. I can't like move anywhere. That's the problem. Um, all right, let's give Cloud an Ether. Then um, we're going to need to fuck. Bring it. Get him. Oh man, we got set in smog. Get ready. That'll do. What a crit. Get ready. Cloud has got a limit break. Aerith is on limit break. I'm going to see them breeze restore moderate amount of party members. Yeah, let's go here. The... Oh, wow. He killed me in the middle of her casting her limit break. Still up for it? It's on you. I'll, I'll do what I can. Let's do this. Um, she's dead. something. I've got no abilities though at the minute to like, heal anybody. 
can't use my ATB at the minute. Um, kill herself. Uh, ATB. Oh, he's pressured, he's pressured. Should really. No! Oh, he's staggered. Ah. Ah, I'm out of stuff. Silence me, I can't even use the frickin' uh That's um, something. I think I need to work harder to get... Um, I need to concentrate more with Aerith to bring up my uh, barriers and things, just to give me that extra defense. I maybe should have also spent a bit of time there just to double check his weaknesses and things. I know he's obviously weak against um, Thunder, but it'd be interesting to see if he's actually weak against anything else. The thing that makes that boss so hard is like when he does his swirling attack he like he um he kind of cuts off the, the the ability to get into him so it's really hard to build your atb gauge and without your atb gauge you can't then use your items or your spells and things you can only attack so um i mean i guess we just gotta wait out and try and Tell you what though, we used a lot of poison's not gonna do anything for it here, but let's use the I think it's the deadly dodge. Yeah, so we're doing quite a bit of dodging, so that might be a good material to have as we roll in and like dodge his because I, I found as he like walks towards me, if I do a dodge, I can avoid his like slashing attack with that big ball on his arm. So we can do that. Um I think it's going to be that like, against fire. I think I should probably put auto cure on Aerith as well.
Okay. Maybe what we'll do is... Hmm. Could be weak against wind, but what we'll do for Aerith is we will give her... Oh, we should maybe use Prey as well. What I want to use here is the Synergy. It must be on there, doesn't it? Well, let's see what we need. I've got another Lightning. We've got lightning. I can pair synergy with lightning. And then what that will do is when cloud attacks, it will Aerith should then cast lightning. Yes, we have. Okay. That's right, isn't it? Allows an ally to follow the leader's attack command with an attack from linked materia. Yeah, okay. So then every time cloud attacks, Aerith should cast lightning. What was that one that Tifa had though? Tifa had something. The auto cure materia. Aerith have a better on fence, I wonder. Nothing with three slots. What I would give right now for an extra materia slot. All right, I'm going to take out healing and I'm going to set it to auto cure that way cloud should get auto cured 10 times in this battle without me having to like do it for him so all right let's let's run with this and see how we get on with this battle then with this setup Where did you cast that to, Cloud? Like, seriously. Steady. Stay back. I'm waiting.
so now I need to... Jeez, he just smacked Cloud for six. for that heal, Aerith. Thank you. Wow. I can't believe you. One more shot. Okay, so <sighs> I took out the raised and I Uh, it's a pretty... I would agree, me, Crit, sir. No, 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 no. Any last words? I'm wide awake now. Ooh, that was close. Hey Guess we should look around. That was very close. I mean, yeah, 110 hit points left. That's all I had. <laughs> Thank goodness for the. Um, Limit break there. Well, yeah, that's all. All it takes, I guess, is um, all it takes, like a little tweak on the the setups and things, and that one worked a lot better. Plus, I had like the experience of how to deal with that boss. I think with like the avoiding its physical attacks. I think when it did like the its circling attacks, I kind of tried to like stay close to the boss. I think that will keep you like. To be able to attack it, but also stay out of like the little plumes of smoke and things that it puts out. So, yeah, a lot of the time it's just about like finding the right strategy and working its weaknesses, and then building um, your attack from there. We'll collect your offering on behalf of the poor. This must be one of her calling cards. I don't see anything else interesting. Let's head back and tell them what we found. Do you anything else interesting? So let's see what we've got here now then. Probably gonna to want to change my setup again. I think the deadly dodge, I think I'm gonna take off wind. Success. Keep assess, but Should have used magic up. 
Oh, it's steel, yeah. We should probably stick steel on. And... Don't need those two. Auto cure would be helpful. Raise. There is raise. Survival. cleansing material and start leveling that up. Get back. I can fight too, you know. I love the fact that that enemy is called Hedgehog Pie. So, you guys, we got this new enemy we want to put it, put in the game, but we don't know what to call it. Any suggestions? Well, it looks like a hedgehog. And I've got a pie in my hand. So let's call it Hedgehog Pie. I would love to like, I would love to hear like the inception of some of like names of characters and enemies and things in certain games. Done. That's fine. Speak to Chadley. Another one of his missions. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. Why? Thank you. I've done it. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. First strike. Oh, I was about to buy two, and then I realized he's like massively inflated the price from like the first to the second. So, um, yeah, I'm not going to be buying any more. To receiving all of your future battle intel Is there a bench there? It was. Let's uh, teal it while we're here. There's like, yeah, the, the first one will cost you 10, and then the next one will cost you 5,000. <laughs> Jeez. one of her famous warnings. It's an incredible find. Oh, was that all? Hold on. Looks like there's something else. A message. To the nosy Shinra reporter sniffing yeah. around, I was planning to teach you a lesson you would never forget. However, by the grace of your mercenary friend, you were spared that lesson. But next time he might not be around to save you, you would be wise to watch your step. Not just a message from the angel. Warning. She's so clearly the angel. If the Merc here hadn't bailed you out, that fiend in the scrap would have ripped you to shreds. 
Sorry about that, friend. Here I was, just trying to help you out. But instead, my kindness almost got you violently killed. Now, now. <laughs> no harm, no foul, right? In any case, I hope this narrowly averted tragedy won't discourage you from sharing information with me in the future. Hey, everybody! The angel left another calling card! She's gonna rip up Don Corneo! Oh, yeah. Damn time! Don Corneo's no easy mark. I can't wait to see how this goes down. Excuse me, I'm a reporter for the Daily Buzz and... So much for my reward. Here, why don't you take this? Oh, and no need to thank me. Let's just say it slipped out of that reporter's pocket. <laughs> Can't call it theft if you're just claiming what you're owed. Am I right? <laughs> well done, Mr. Merck. You certainly lived up to your reputation. We probably ought to call it a day. Getting late, huh? You've been working so hard you lost track of time. Had to. The pace sucked. Because they didn't know if you were worth it yet. But now they do. Come on, let's go home. Alright. Now what could our angel want from a man like Don Corneo of all his many goodies? Or maybe she wants his whole fortune. So, uh, remember that name. That's all I'm going to say. Remember the name Don Corneo. It's, uh... That's where we'll be heading off shortly. Oh, it's rude. Rude. <laughs> Atten. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. I think we got ourselves another boss fight. Don't take it personal. <laughs> you Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You'll want to talk. No need to get rough. Stay back. I'm waiting. Go on. So, let's get Cloud buried up. Man, I gotta work on my dodging. I know I've said that. What the hell is he doing? his glasses is gonna be mad they're gonna be mad so, you had enough yet? and he's got another pair of glasses straight away I that I <laughs> oh, that's great Just stop it. Camp. it's my job 
think about changing careers. I wonder if he kills Cloud whether that's the fight over because the, the Turks are actually trying to capture Ares so Seriously. I see you. Stay back. You'll feel better in a second. Everything. My turn. Too easy. You know. Gotta be careful. This is I got my freaking limit break again. I'm here. I'm just so tired. Hang back. You're out of luck. I think I can. I'm here. Okay. It's your turn. I got this. Come on. I'm feeling pretty weak. I'm weak. Oh, really soft. Got your number. I'm waiting. I won't give up. I'll do 
Sorry guys, I'm like full on concentration mode at the Be minute. Careful. I can't like dodge out. If I hit him like three or four times, he instantly kind of like just wrecks me. There's no stopping it. Right, I think I've got it. I think I've got him. Just comes along and goes. Just leave us fight alone. over. <laughs> you know I can't do that. Hey there, partner. I'm sure you're having the time of your life, but we're needed on standby for a job. It's something about Sector Seven. So get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? You know I can't do that. Pick up before. But uh, yeah, perks are interesting, to say the least. So, you coming? Yeah. Like, weird part, like... One thing I would say about this game is, like, it's parts, the controls just don't seem to be really hard to, like, control where the cloud is walking. Uh, you talking to this? So, yeah. It was that kind of day. <sighs> Let's go. Shouldn't keep mom waiting. Hey, what'd they say? Good work today, guys. Kidding. They didn't say a word. But, you know... Uh, never mind. It's not like you'd believe me, after all. Hmm. Probably not. Oh. <laughs> Tell me anyway. Really? Yeah. 
the uh, character for Cloud. Now. The flowers, they... They have something important to tell us. Something they... Need to share with us. At least, that's the feeling I get. But, before they can... There's a final step that has to be taken. Otherwise, we won't hear them. Maybe I should just give up. Honestly, it's what I do best. Could have fooled me. From what I've seen, you're no quitter. Well, today's special. That's why I've been working my butt off. Uh, what's so special about it? <laughs> okay, time to go. So special about today. To talk to her. Did the flower say anything? Uh, good work today, guys. <laughs> That's the spirit. Yeah, character for Cloud. Yep, that's the one I like. Anywho, grab some grub. All right. You're heading in already. No, nah, not quite yet. What else am I meant? Yeah. You're heading in already? Yeah, that's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry, we got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back! Good! Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? Yikes. Mara's like, I've never been so proud. Leave Aries alone. Leave Aerith alone. The man That's Cloud's the mama. Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. Flash back to when Cloud I'd visited his hometown. I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl. I could keep you. I find it quite strange that like the bed's in the, the middle of the kitchen. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. Stay my welcome. I wonder. Yeah, you gotta sneak out. So in the original, you had to like sneak out, and if you went too quick, Aerith would come out of her room, like in that little um, little cutscene there, and she pushes you back into the room. So. Interesting. 
But I mean, come on, look at the state of this house. Seriously. Do some tidying up. What are you doing? Uh, uh, nothing. What did I run Did into? you have a bad dream? <laughs> Don't worry. You'll feel much better in the morning. And I promise to take you straight home. Uh, okay. Please don't let her hear me again. Not sure why I actually like caught myself on that time. Thought I'd cleared everything. I think if this was me though, I just like I just like I was trying to sneak out and there was stuff like this all all over. I'd probably just like pick things up as I went along. It would probably be easy. You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was warrior. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Lyra is a bit uh, protective, isn't she? Escorted her home, kept her safe, and you chucked me out in the middle of the night. It isn't the new florist. I appreciate you helping the kids out today. Thank you. They won't stop talking about the soldier who saved the day. Hmm. Oh, and make sure to give my thanks to Aerith, too. Sure. Who knew talking to the kids about the death? All right, well. I head this way, which we have. Are you ready for the surprise? Surprise! <laughs> well, look who it is. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. <sighs> <laughs> Lead on then. With pleasure. <laughs> uh oh. Cloud? Is something wrong? It's nothing. All right. You can see the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in. So what I'll say, Mika, is if that enemy I was talking about before is going to be in the game, we're going to find it in a moment. 
because this is the plot this is the section in the original game where you would fight it so there weren't a lot living there so. at the time but and that's the underside of sector 6 wall market a real special place but i'm sure you already knew that right i didn't tell you I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, Yeah, we still might come across it, Mika. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing. Which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. And now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Want to see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. Oh, I want to go to Wall Market. Ah. Oh. Market is very interesting part of the game. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> I don't like following characters. I can't go very fast. I have to kind of go at their speed, and I like to sort of like run ahead. I can't. Collapsed you know, expressway. Ever since the plate fell. And there's no other way? It'll be an adventure. If you... Don't uh, knock the disco music. Is that it? Um. What's that? A big arm. Kind of cute, don't you think? Uh. Oh, great. Someone's pulled up the ladder. I wonder if we can use this. Happens to be a control panel. Uh, raise low the arm, rotate the arm. Aerith, climb. 
Only load or unload the arm with the area marked by the yellow. Safety. It's this way. Here's an idea. I'll hop on and you give me a ride. Are you serious? Absolutely. I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb up after. I was just about to say, so then how do I get up? Comes probably a, a boss well, that I gotta fight on my own, right? Waiting for it. Waiting for it. I'm gonna get gooned, I know I am. You did it! Yeah. Uh. Hmm? Alright, good enough. Let's keep on trucking. <laughs> keep on trucking. Choo choo! That's the train. Oh, oh. Stop. Did we make it up? Come on. Auto robot, that auto. Um, I'm waiting. What? I tell you what, I'm struggling with at the minute. A lock on thing. The lock-on thing's like really weird. It kind of like keeps turning itself off. I don't know if it's like because after a certain distance, maybe it, you can't do it anymore. I blocked it all because of all the monsters that kept showing up. Pretty dangerous place for kids to play. Raised in the slums, remember? You're tough. Hmm, that's supposed to be a compliment. I I'd take it if I was you. Don't get much better than that. <laughs> and if you like this disco music, uh, um, like I said, just wait, just you wait until we'll mark it. That's the place. It's the place we don't ask questions. Just to accept what it is. Yes, it's nope. I've got this. Don't you mean we've got this? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
for a chest, though. Just here. One thousand gill. Backpack. Clearly, that's the way we've got to go. like down here was going to go, so that's why I didn't go that way. But... Looks like a dead end. more of the same on here. They've got to move another round. Cross to the... Oh! 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 Where did they come from? Smogged. I bet you can grab that container with the arm. I bet I can. Uh, so, the same again, but X is grab or relief. I do what with my hand? <laughs> it always gotta be so tough. Lucky for me, you'll make this easier. Yes, ma'am. Well then, I'm gonna head down. Alright, so now I gotta do. Oh, hold on. I got. I did it wrong. I gotta place container first. Then pick up Aerith. Want to ride? <sighs> yep. 
Yeah, he's very much like he doesn't know what to do, isn't he? Cloud's not really a very social person. Oh. I can get that materia only if I do this then. Gotcha. <sighs> if it's like something, maybe if I put it on the other side, I don't know. It'll soon tell me if um, there's more to fetch, right? Okay, right there. Hold on while I drop the ladder. Don't run off. Don't run off. Whoa, not too fast, okay? Got it. I assume this is the right way, that's a shame. know something's going to come out of the water. Knock us in. No. It's just us. Mm. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? More to the point, Aerith. Probably somebody who's going to kill Maybe us around that. here. <laughs> Besides, looky here, boys. Caught us some burglars. Come into our homes and stealing our shit. Doing crime. <laughs> I'd say we're owed compensatory damages. <laughs> Government uh, composite. I don't get it. <laughs> How stupid can you be? It's crazy simple. <laughs> compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation for damages. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what you get when you, uh, when somebody else. We uh, haven't done anything wrong. Yeah. We were just passing through. Oh, a likely story. Okay, what do you want? Nothing but our due recompense, that's all. <laughs> due recompense, due recompense, due, due recompense? No <laughs> shit, we'll bring. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know what he said, so he just goes back to what he said the first time. I think we've heard enough. Got to 
think it's safe to say that these guys aren't the... Um... I think it's safe to say that they're um, they're just some thugs, and they won't be troubling us much more. I kind of want to go back though. I I want to check out the upper area because I thought the lower area would be like a secret rather than going the other way. But I'm gonna go check it out real quick. Make sure we didn't miss anything. I think those guys actually do look a bit familiar from the original. I think they are um, some of Don Corneo's thugs from Wall Market. Also, this is why we uh, we check things out. Look, Osmo Canyon, please. I really wish Cosmo can because the gems. Yeah, and all of that material. Buy one of them for Aerith. Equip. Uh, we'll equip the that accessory to Aerith. health and then we'll uh, head back down oh they're still down there plane dead Let's head on back. Still playing dead. Surely he can't be very comfortable like that. Shit! Let's get the hell out of here! Who are you guys? Don't leave me! I'm coming! Question, but 
Why did you quit being a soldier? That is random. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Uh. Um, did you have any soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. Goons there. Huh? What we got here? I'm waiting. Fresh meat to test our new toy on the gas. <laughs> Guy ran away, didn't he? He just like stole our thing. Then he just like ran away. So it's my turn? Those um, those sweepers are pretty darn tough. Stupid ladders, always out of reach. Okay, Cloud, heading down. You're in charge of the arm. Got it. This looks like a proper sort of puzzle. This one, jeez. Triangle this time switches. Okay. Cloud. Do that one, and then we'll go and get Aerith. She can go and get that piece of material for us. Magnifying material. Gotcha. That is. All right. So now we're going to swap arms. Yes. Not. 
All that barbecue in Mika. <laughs> Oh, maybe I need to stack them up. Maybe. Don't think I can pick that up though while Aerith is stood there, so I've got, it looks like I've got to move this one first. Yeah, I don't blame you, Mika, if you're tired. Go and uh, hit the hay, man. So now that's there, I think. Now I want to grab this one. Yes. Move it across. That should now give me a common place to... Cloud. Still there, Mika. No worries. Enjoy your sleep, buddy. Thanks for hanging. Appreciate it, as always. So now we can put Aerith on the yellow area. Swap her. Cloud ever gets like fed up of mercenary work, I think he can definitely just uh, become a crane operator. Uh, it appears you are the last man standing at him, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the lift. I'll have that ladder down for you in a sec. Most kind. thing is though I don't like I don't really expect a lot of people to be in these streams because it's so far it's it's so separated from my normal kind of streaming content and what I've like developed my channel on so I think a lot of people that subscribe to the channel probably don't aren't interested in this sort of thing so but you know case or that went pretty well sure did I kind of rather just play games that I want to play and enjoy playing as opposed to like playing something that I don't just to get the views kind of thing. So, yeah, still playing Final Fantasy Doctress. Will be for a considerable amount of time. Welcome back. Hope you're well. But yeah, I'm definitely, I definitely enjoy playing a variety of games. Hold it right there, You want to pass through our territory? Then you gotta pay the coal. I'm waiting. Yikes! Yeah. 
Aerith is now level 19. I think Dr. Stone just uh, returned, actually. Hey, it's the playground! It's the playground! Gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time <laughs> Up for... Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on! <laughs> Story time. You know, a long time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh, yeah? <clears throat> I was just saying, Doctress, I kind of, I, I would rather play games that I want to play rather than play a game just for the popularity. I, I, get, I personally get more enjoyment out of that. And whether there's like one person or like 100 people here, um, it doesn't deter me. You know, I enjoy playing games. I enjoy streaming my, my playthrough of games. So, you know, I know every, not everything I play is going to be everybody's cup of tea and I appreciate that. So, yeah. If people, if people want to come and hang, that's fine. If they don't want to hang, that's fine. You know, that's the way I've always looked at it. Soldier first class, right? I mean, if I was, if I really wanted to sort of like go for the popularity, I'd be streaming something like Fortnite or Apex or, you know, trying to play the popular games, which I wouldn't enjoy. I'll be honest, I don't enjoy those sorts of games. So, but yeah. Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. Back. What's his name? You probably know him. Uh, are you okay? Missed his name, Cloud. Because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <clears throat> Gotta look forward, not back. Hydrate there, uh, Doctress. Thank you very much. Probably means I'll be uh, up every half an hour now uh, visiting the toilet <laughs> when I'm trying to sleep. Oh, whee! oh my god. Yeah, I want to play here. This is it. This is it. We're done. Playthrough is finished, boys. We're going to play in the park for the rest of it. Next 20 hours, we're just going to ride the slide. <laughs> Can I go on the swing? This I can go on the swing. Ah, uh, swing, man. 
I think you could I think you could go on the, on this slide in the original. Sure you could. So there's so many little bits that like they're, they're just it's just the little things for me in this game when I see them in the remake and it's like oh my god they put that in oh my god they did that and it's just like the nostalgia for me. Oh, I can't go on the, the twisty slide though. I think everyone's feeling a little bit burnt out of the of a recent atom, to be fair. Here. Hmm. There's that, and quite a few of them are actually working as part of, like, on the DA mod and the uh, Desolation mod and other bits and pieces. So I think just, like, life is getting in the way of, of people as well at the minute. Ready? Want to get to Sector 7 in style? This is the passageway for you. Keyboard, did you go for, Doctress? So, <laughs> go ahead. Stay sword off your back here. You gonna be okay getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. <sighs> <laughs> Don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies, and it's safer too. <sighs> Why did we go the dangerous way? Okay. Guess this is it then. Ready? Go. Yeah. Wait a minute. To be honest, uh, Doctor, so I've never had a mechanical keyboard, so I can't comment on. Fair. I've had the, the keyboard I've got is is nothing special. It's just like a wireless Microsoft one, and I bought this when I was at university back in. I bought it in my second year of university in two thousand and six, and I still use it to this day. I've had it for fifteen years, and it's I I, I love it. I love it. Oh no, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know Corneo. I don't use the mouse Doesn't anymore. But I, I, I've got a wired mouse. Are. But, um, the yeah, the wireless keyboard, I love it. You. It's just the shape and where the buttons are and everything. To meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. The other month, actually, I, I say, I, at, some point, at some point last year, I actually took all of the keys off and gave it a proper deep clean, so... That's how much I, I care for this keyboard. In there. You have to help her. Come on. Okay. Ares left on, the party. We gotta hurry. Ares rejoined the party. I said Ares. Real name is Aerith. And blame the there was a mistranslation in the um in the uh european and english versions of final fantasy 7 when it came over from japan and they mistranslated her name to Ares. so a lot of people call her Ares, but uh should be Aerith. so if i say the incorrect name i do apologize so um 
A little warning, guys. We're coming up to War Market. And things are going to get a little weird. You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl here? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what she look like? She literally well, just came through here. She's in great shape. She's a great fighter. She's great at handling books. Well, she is our, like, childhood sweetheart, so let's say she's in great shape. She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. Jealous you much? talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's going to be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next <laughs> Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? What are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. Oh, and there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. Uh-oh. Guys, welcome to... Market. Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side, even whatever you're into, we got you. Got it's like the Vegas of the slums. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? All right, so we're going to want to go to Cuneo's mansion. Relaxation, the sweet embrace of pretty ladies. Oh, that's what I need. We going, Johnny? This is the place it gets weird. That is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? <laughs> I knew it. Let me guess. After you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self-loathing. But it only lasts a moment, doesn't it? Next thing you know, oh, we're going to run into something a lot worse than enemies, Adam. Trust me. <laughs> Tifa, my love, my light, who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up, I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why. Oh God, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She keep looking for me to beg me not to leave She didn't, her. Johnny, no. <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you. Tifa, I'm coming, baby. Who was that? Nobody you want. 
no need to know. My apologies, sir. We are not ready to open at this time. But What? Uh, aren't you that leaf house? Uh, hey, what the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? Uh, well, if you must know... So, the woman who works the orphanage like doubles as a night to live blank. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. There wasn't Aerith with me a minute ago. I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. So by day, she looks after the orphans in Sector 5 slums. And by night, she's, um, well, yeah. I'll let you decide for yourself. <laughs> At this moment. Gotta stay sharp though. Lifetime bands or lifetime bands. I don't want to say too much too soon. to be prepared for the worst wouldn't you agree quality monster insurance is more essential What's than that ever. you're very interested only in our premium strong. policy will do for you it's always best to be prepared for the worst wouldn't you agree all right i can't get that chest maybe i can like get rid of the books or something no no way oh you'll you'll get it when we get there you'll get it when we get there don't you worry let's just say it's the Honey Bee Inn is a um, specialized kind of adult club. I think we'll just leave it at that for now. Chocobo Ranch thing. Even if you love the artist, you don't need more than one copy. <laughs> Alright, so set back up here. This is buzzing. Now we are meant to be going to Borneo's mansion, which is up here. my shot, Aerith. <laughs> I wanted to take a screenshot of that.
Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Wall Market. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute. Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on. Can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're going to need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Okay, so... Without... Bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. Without, um, saying anything... Let me pose a question to you. The question is, what do you think is going to happen next? And to help you make your decision, bear in mind what Leslie just said, which was, um, only pretty girls can get in. That's all I'm going to say. You can guess what is about to happen. Then, good on you. <laughs> Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas, that is really. incorrect. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate, huh? But. To earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio, right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. The sharpest shed. Welcome to Wall Market's premier weapon shop. What you got? Sure, I'll buy it. I don't particularly want to equip it right now, but I'll buy it. Yeah, Johnny's a, a nutter. Do come again. Thinks Tifa loves him, but hey there, sweetie. Tifa doesn't like him at all, I don't think. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I don't think we can do anything here, but um, squats mini game.
Thank you. I signed with Shina Records a while back, but I'm still looking for my first big hit. It's been seven years now. Not easy, but you gotta do what you love. And I love to sing. This is a new song of mine. It got Radio blues. Number one. Is this the place where... Yeah, this is the place. Come on, asshole! Hurry the hell up! That poor guy. That guy needs to go to the, um, the lavatory. There is already a guy in there who uh, needs some assistance, so... Try the recommended special. Hey there, friend. Grab a seat. Any seat that's open. What about that barbecue I'm cooking? He says I can't. I think I can. I don't think I can actually do anything. Places maybe until I've started a conversation. First. That sounds like some CD 80s adult movie music. Alright, let's go and show up to this guy. What were you thinking? Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. I tell you what, this guy, this guy sounds like, um, I don't know if either of you watch Family Guy, he sounds just like the guy who, um, oh, what was his name? Somebody West, he was like Adam West's, in, in a quite a recent series, he was Adam West's cousin, and he came and he ran for mayor, and he like took over to be mayor of Quahog. He sounds just like that guy. Wild West, that was his name. Wild West in Family Guy. It sounds just like him. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Misty. Heads or tails. Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. Um. Our deal. If there's a right answer.
heads. Hail, you lose. I didn't know that before I even looked at it, though. Hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, not just the Mio. Now get that one. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? <laughs> see, look, called it. Yeah, it did change color on. And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Alright, so Sam's not gonna help us. I guess they're closed right now. I feel rejuvenated and alive. Like I've got a brand new body. So we need to go to the massage parlor. But the massage parlor is closed. Yeah, if you don't pick a chat color on Twitch, it um, assigns you a random color, I believe. We're uh... Oh, we've already been this way. Oh, of course, that leads back to Sector 5, yeah. Of course, we took the... Uh... I, I realise now, we took the left path before. Because we weren't going to Wall Market. We went left there, didn't we? But of course. Got the knock, knock pog sunglasses emote from Doctorus right there. Alright, well, I think, given that we're kind of like just about to embark on some new main quest stuff here, like looking for the, the trio, probably as good a place as any to leave it for today. So, yeah, thank you very much, everybody, for tuning in tonight. I really appreciate it. We will be back tomorrow night, continuing and picking this up. And we'll also be back tomorrow at uh, 1, 1 30 p.m. G uh, BST, sorry where we're going to play some more portal community chambers. So come by, say hi if you can. If not, I appreciate it anyway. And uh, 
Hope you have a good rest of the day, whatever you are doing. And until next time, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Take care. Good night. Happy gaming.